Welcome to Mega Arch Design. As you can see here, this is unique, wonderful high-rise tower. So in this channel, you will learn how to design this kind of relevant tower, multi-story, floor-to-floor plan, how to design and balcony, floor-to-floor design, office floor plan, and residential, commercial purposes, number of parking inside our towers, basement floor plan. ground floor plan number of services substation number of lift number of stair of fire exit all those thing will cover in this channel so like this channel follow this channel you will get lot of things to learn how to make this tower possible we will finalize this uh, furniture layout for our bedroom to living to kitchen to sofa our inner living and for dining and for bedroom computer table as you can see we have placed each and every pair proper way in very much proper way kitchen room with refrigerator stove a washing machine so we will make how to place we will learn how to place we will provide one by one you after that you can see we have located each and every pair we just made this apartment and we have located that uh, in our uh, final mega plan you can see our toilet room and uh, kitchen room sink with uh, stove with the fridge washing machine our shower tray our sink our wash basin water closet inside bedroom we have provided sofa computer table and bed and dwell chair with table all thing we have placed in very much proper and very much convenient way and we have finalized something like this and we have placed each and everywhere in very much proper way so we will uh, learn how to place with the standard sizes and uh, everywhere in very much proper manner so in this video you will see how we place as uh, you can see this is a number of 12 apartment and uh, we have made this two option only and we have relocated in very much proper way and very much convenient way Uh, for for this plan just we will learn how to place our furniture layout with the space and uh, utilities and uh, as per minimum condition requirement and rest of the thing like sofa tv computer table dining all the thing we will cover in this in this video one by one you can see uh, rest of the part minimum uh, we were uh, the main thing we have follow the sizes standard sizes like bathroom uh, shower tray minimum requirement 180 and for uh, bed king size bed minimum requirement 2 meter for and we have provided dress also sink wash basin and stove number of washing machine in kitchen as per requirement number of sink minimum cabinet space everything we have discussed in this final video so keep watching we will start one by one how to make this thing possible in very much easy and very much convenient way so what we will do we will make just this two plan and we will place here in very much proper way so you can see here we have this blank uh, full plan layout without furniture and we will place in this apartment our uh, sink wash basin dining sofa dining table wash basin shower tray our computer table all furniture layout we will place one by one in bedroom in our kitchen room wide living area everywhere as you can see this is our final plan without furniture layout so now we will place this uh, in this final plan our furniture layout okay fine as you can see we will uh, make this one and again we will mirror the same as you when check just we have made this two plan only and we have placed everywhere with proper mirror and scale option with alignment and uh, this our another apartment with wide balcony we have already discussed in our previous video about this apartment spacing and minimum maximum space requirement 
and uh, functionalities you can see in previous video so today we are going to place our final furniture layout in this plan so as you can see this is our master bedroom attached bathroom we will place bathroom our shower tray water closet wash basin computer table rest of the dress area and all those things we will cover one by one so we will see how we place we will also follow the same standard sizes maximum and minimum size condition for our furniture layout because this is very important to keep furniture layout in proper spacing maximum we can provide but in minimum case we must try to understand the basic standard and we also place in this kitchen as you can see 350 by 450 we will place our sink and washing machine fridge stove in storeroom we will place so as you can see this plan is here we have just made two plan this is locating this place and another is locating in this corner this one so we will just place these two furniture layout and rest of the part we will locate in very much proper way so I will select and I will move here so I already copied that uh, blocks for our like bed table dining table water closet shower tray sink sofa computer table TV set with the standard sizes so we already have copied here and you can see here so now we are going to place in very much proper way so as you can see this is our dining area so we will place here and this is a standard uh, minimum size is required for 150 so we have more than that so this is our dining area and this is our sofa we will keep in this living something like this and I will make a proper rotation and I will move here so I will make a mirror again another side like this so we have this three case sofa in between we will place our table and TV set also I will put TV set here all the sizes is uh, as per our minimum requirement or more than that so this is our TV table fine the basic thing is when we are keeping uh, our furniture layout so so easy to make uh, electrical schedules and electrical layout electrical drawing the connection and the cabinet and the distribution box and connections electric board so this part become very important when we give furniture plan with the layout so for electrical purpose it's most widely used and also we understand the basic concept where we are locating so it's a many purpose we can uh, utilize after keeping furniture layout fine so we will place the table for our paper or newspaper or our coffee timing fine as you can see we have given space also for our balcony access okay I will put in proper place so this is the final dining with sofa and TV set I will move it a little bit here so this is the final so we will go in toilet and we I will put this wash basin here and this water closet here it is very important to understand where we are locating because if you locate proper place so it will go for sanitary and our water supply become it should be as per our pipeline flow if you are locating here so we have to provide the duct and the, we have to understand the space of duct where the duct is locating how the pipeline will go from here to duct and through high level so we will place like this and this is on exact place so you can see this are very big in size so later we will scale this part 
double chair with circle table fine I will put it here we can keep our carpet also because we have a lot of space okay fine it's 375 480 approximate we have a wide lobby okay so again we will use this to our another bathroom attached bathroom we will use this here when we are opening the door it should be in front of door or near the door for quick access we have to keep this in mind and something like this so when we enter we can easily access our wash basin fine so you can see minimum size is 63 approximate 2 feet so it's I think it's much more than that we can keep 1.5 feet one point means uh, 18 inch so I will scale 0.75 now fine okay so I will take this water closet and I will keep here and I will rotate on proper place fine I will move a little bit here so rest of the thing our shower this is our shower tray we must have to locate the draining area through our water closet it become uh, easy for sanitary drying and sanitary and water supply fine we will scale this minimum size for shower tray should be 180 minimum this part we can utilize for our utilities or other services like our general use products fine minimum space between water closet to shower tray should be 30 so we have very much proper and we have wider space okay fine so you can say we have arranged this bath area in very much smooth way this is our 170, 179, approximately 180 and fine and we will go the next we are going to place this master bedroom bed king size to here we, we must have to understand the concept where we are placing suppose we are entering in front we can't keep for privacy purpose it should be somewhere like uh, nobody can see directly where you sitting or where you uh, sleeping mode whatever because it should be somewhere in privacy privacy manner so suppose I am keeping here if someone access uh, through so they will access through corridor and then they, are, they, they will not see directly where the people are properly sitting or in this manner so we have to put our bed in very much proper way and perfect location also we must have to consider this point we should we must not provide in front of door in front of door entrance ok I will keep this at the corner for our sitting area because we have very wide space and I will make scale after keeping because this already we have very wide and very big in size due to our big size bedroom we can keep otherwise no use to keep here but we have a big size room 550 meter so we can keep here I will take a move and fine I will take scale 0.5 fine so we can see the minimum should be 1 feet uh, 30 centi it's ok 1 feet space for our small chair and table and uh, something like this fine as you can see we are going to place our lamp table I will make a copy I will keep here so this is our lamp table our safe a small safe Okay, I will make explode, I will list it, it should be 60 by 60 we can keep normally, minimum space we are providing. 
Okay, fine. I will make a mirror for another side. Something like this. Yes, so you can see both sides we have placed our lamp table with safe. Okay, now we will copy this. I will take a small scale mode, maybe uh, approximate 30 or 40 centi. I will copy this computer table and I will place this something this corner because we have a space. So I will take a move. Okay. Fine. So we have this computer table and I will make a move. So you can see a dress room or uh, dress section already we have, so no need to provide. So we have this king size bed with 12, two, so one lamp and one, one uh, our safe with two chair table and one computer table. So finally this bedroom is very much perfect. So you can see this is our dress section. We can keep our cupboard area for our dress. So in this bedroom everything is fine, located very much perfectly. So the main thing when you are connecting electricity so you can access easily what the thing is locating where and what we place exactly which point. Fine. I will take a copy. Again I will put here something. So you can see this is our another. I will, this, I will keep this table. Our table is here. Fine. I will make a move, something like this. So this is our another bedroom. We have kept another computer table, a small for kids or any other purpose. We have dress room given this in this corner. And I will make a copy. One thing here you see this we have given this uh, when you open the door directly you see the bed. So you can relocate because we don't have space there, we don't have proper spacing. Otherwise, we can keep another location. For now, we will keep in, uh, for your reference, for your understanding. And we can relocate somewhere else also to keep in mind. It must be over the door, not in front of door. Okay. We are placing this uh, shower tray. And rest of the part will go service, water, sanitary, this kind of our chef. And this part will be utilized I like our other services, daily normal use product, normal use services. Okay, so we have other space here. Fine. This is our 180. Again, we will place this to here. In our bathroom. So this is our completely fine, everything is okay. Keep remember in uh, wash basin we must have to place the mirror also. So we can fix the mirror above the uh, wash basin. I will take 60, this kitchen is very important for cabinet to keep 60, minimum spacing, maximum you can give 80 or 90 depending on sizes but minimum sizes should be 60 something like this in the 60 we will cover our sink and our washing machine below and our refrigerator our stove fine Okay, we will keep here one stove, 60 by 60 we can provide or more than that, uh, so we can provide up to 80 depending on size, maximum we can provide 80 no issue, I will, I will take uh, 4 oven, uh, sorry 4 lamp, so this number of 4, four lamp in our uh, this stove. We are making roughly just for your concept for 
proper clarifications we will give different color i will make a offset for little smooth and uh, looks so nice so this is our stove and we will place our uh, fridge a washing machine area 60 by 60 fine something like this it uh, it should be um, uh, below the cabinet okay i will match it with this to this fine I will make a offset for inside and so as you can see our washing washing machine and stove is ready and we are going to place our fridge and this area we can this is our opening for exhaust and other services this is because we are we are locating through duct so we can provide our duct services here also and we will place here fridge approximate 60 by 60 fine we can keep 60 or 70 um, based on your space uh, but uh, minimum size for 60 we can keep okay fine this we are considering our opening handle okay so we will match this to this i will take offset and i will match with this to this finally we have arranged the kitchen also and everything is completely ready as you can see our kitchen our bathroom bedroom dining everything is ready i will keep this fridge i will copy and I will keep WM this is a washing machine okay fine this all thing we are following as per our standard rule regulation if you are for your basic and general concept we are placing this as per our rule regulation if you submit in this scenario so it will get approval otherwise uh, less than that it's not possible to get approval so we are following through our standard how to uh, submit uh, through planning and uh, through municipality all those things so we are following as per standard sizes so if, for example if you have corridor we give 100 cm they will not allow for toilet if we give 60 cm they will not allow so door sizes other sizes must be as per requirement so we are placing we are following the same method what requirement exactly i will i will select all and i will make a block once fine something here okay fine i will make this block because this apartment if you block so we can easily uh, we will take a reference point because it meets our archive and i will take this reference point i will move it out and fine so I will select this all furniture layout and I will deselect this wall and I will make this block because we are going to place each and every 
apartment as you know we have mirrored this in very much proper way in this number of six apartment so we are going to place I will make a copy and something like this and I will put here okay so you can see we have placed in very much proper way and again this reference point we have to relocate another place I will take mirror I will put no okay so you can see another apartment is completely fine everything is as it is as you made in our previous final plan and now I will sell it again I will make a move mirror I will make like this so you can see we are getting another here and another here so number of four apartment is ready we have just made one only and we have mirror in very much proper way so again I will take like this and mirror shows no object so you can see number of six apartment is completely ready as you can see this is our we will see the overview this is our dining with sofa tv set and our wide living with the bedroom bed chair with table computer table shower tray kitchen everything is fine everywhere everywhere is everything is fine because we have made the same plan and we, we have mirror in very much proper way okay so everything is okay as you can see so this is another apartment the same with two bedroom kitchen living and dining two and a half bathroom one wide bed one bedroom what we will do we will do the same thing and we will place here our furniture layout so i will place this dining area here we are keeping everything in mind like uh, kitchen should be near to dining for the purpose for the purpose we can access easily okay so we are here very wide space in living i will keep copy and i will put here so this is our tv set I will copy these two and as we discussed uh, about the door, when we open the door, we should access quickly to wash basin. So it is, it is as it is. Okay. In front uh, we have water closet. We will take move, small move. Fine. Again, I will copy this chair with table. I will keep this in our in, inside living because we have very wide living. We can keep our carpet area and double sofa also because we have a lot of space there. So you can see this kitchen is in chamfer space. So what we will do? We will make an offset sixty and something like this, and we will place the thing perfectly. And we are given this outer window. I will make a copy. Okay. I will rotate properly. Fine. As you can see, this is on correct. Yes. I will select another color. We can select a layer for our furniture layout. We already selected. We are just changing the color. Now I will copy the stove section, I will keep there, fine, so we can keep here, I will rotate something like this, I will take a move, okay, fine. Because we have a lot of space, we can arrange our washing machine and fridge rest of the thing in very much proper way I will put washing machine here keep in mind we are keeping this in should be below because over the uh, over the cabinet uh, it will come a wooden door 
with the cabinet for utilities. So we are keeping three here. Add another corner. Fine. You can see we have given main room 240 by 180 approximate. It is very very small main room for just for store purpose. We can use store purpose also. For now we just place in main room. Okay, our fridge is final. As you can see, everything is fine. Okay. I will match this to this. Our kitchen 330 by 350 by chamfer, it will get more than that. Our corridor 140. We are going to place our king size bed in our bedroom. I will copy this. As you can see, this is very chamfer bedroom. So we will place in very much perfect way. I will make block. Block becomes easy because uh, sometimes we select and rest of the part, rest of the line got missed. So better to make block the thing if you are using regularly. Fine. Okay, something like this. We will make a rotate. Okay. I will move and down. I will move a little bit after rotation. Okay, fine. So you can see rest of the thing we can use from both sides. And this is our, we will take offset, we will take offset and we will take a straight alignment to keep our bed in very much straight way. Something like this. Okay, I will take the line, source object, no. Fine. We have very wide space, this is bedroom. Now I will place this our computer table. I will rotate. Okay, better to keep that way because we have a very wide space. So I will take a rotate and something like this and I will take a big move over here. So as you can see, I will take move over here. Okay, something like this. So you can see we have very wide space. I will take move something like this. Fine. We are getting very wide space and we are going to place our this uh, double chair with this small table for our seating. We have placed very much proper way and you can see rest of the part we can keep cupboard on the above in, bet in between bedroom and our double chair in uh, bed, uh, bed and double chair and again we are going to place this area and I will copy and I will paste another computer table. I will copy from here. Okay, we will keep that corner, something like this. Okay, we will take a move. Everything is fine. As you can see, uh, I, will, I will keep this one also here. Okay, as you can see, we have given this room. It means we can provide our cupboard inside. We have a lot of space. And rest of the bedroom, we will uh, bathroom. We will place our shower tray and wash basin with water closet. Okay. So minimum requirement 180. So you can see we have 190 approximate. No issue. Fine. And we'll copy this sink. Sorry, this wash basin something here, I will rotate, and I will take move, fine, I will take this water closet and I will copy, same I will pay because we are the same direction. This plan is very much chamfered but everything inside is rectangle. So no issue, when architects decide how to keep the things like this, so it comes very much perfect way like I design you can see, 
this is completely our design and we have just made for your understanding and very much proper okay this is this this is space you can see we are getting very wide space something like this i will keep here and okay fine in this bathroom we are getting very uh, wide space in uh, shower area for the reason we can place our chef and our rest of the thing and utilities so no issue I will copy this water closet here and I will mirror something like this finally as you can see everything is ready we have finalized our this another apartment now we will select and we will block again I will select everything as we select in previous okay fine we did not provide in bedroom anything because maybe it's possible to keep store or anything else fine okay i will make a block we can give any name now i will copy through reference point and we are going to place in our final mega plan this is wonderful mega uni floor plan design we will make another floor plan for office purpose another floor plan for a number of parking and miscellaneous floor plan like gymnasium swimming pool rest of the thing we will cover one by one so now again I will take this mirror and I will give this point to this okay so you can see we got this two here also if you like this channel you can subscribe and you can support to keep subscribe and keep continued learning in next video we will discuss about our next floor plan like ground floor plan services number of column support load bearing and other utilities we will discuss section elevation rest of the part we will see one by one okay fine so you can see everything is fine and we have made this thing in very much proper way we have just made two plan and we have mirror in very much proper way so you can see everything is located each and everywhere in very much smooth and very much proper so finally we made this furniture layout is completely ready in next video we will pay, we will place a column layout also and next floor plan like office floor plan or number of parking floor plan we will consider this 40 floors 10 floor offices swimming pool gymnasium one floor ground floor may be possible for basement services rest of the thing we will discuss in next video so